Hey everyone, I hope you're having a great day. I know I am. Uh, today's topic is going to be about communication. Communication is so important. It's the foundation of every relationship that we're in and is the key to a positive, happy, healthy relationship. Whether it's with your boss, your colleague, a loved one, your friends, your family, the only way to have a healthy relationship is through healthy communication. What is healthy communication? Well, first of all, it's not building up resentment, anger, and thoughts inside of yourself it's getting it out and it's getting it out in a healthy way so how are we going to deliver what we want to say are we going to be thoughtful and mindful of the other people person's feelings are we going to be on the defense all these things are questions to ask yourself before you go into the conversation because you don't want to be on the defense you do want to be thoughtful and mindful of the other person you have to remember that the other person may not be the same kind of communicator you are so you have to let go of expectations of how they're going to take this, how they're going to respond because they they may not be there yet. They may not be used to this. Also, they may prefer to text and um, email or um, do other ways of communication, but not in person, not voice to voice, not that way. So you have to remember that the person you're dealing with is not you. Um, it's also very, very important to be an active listener. So when a person is talking to you and communicating their side of things, you have to remember that you have to listen to what they're saying and not think about what's coming next and what you want to say and how you want to respond. Because when we're doing that, when we're busy thinking, which I often do um, and I'm working on, we're not listening. And you're really not responding to what the person's th saying then. You're responding to what you think they're going to say. And that's not fair. It's not giving the relationship a fair shot. We also have to remember that we have to come with an open heart and vulnerability. For so often, for so long, we've been hurt. Our hearts are closed because of traumatic experiences we've been through. Non-traumatic experiences that just aren't fun. People talking down to us, not saying nice things. Us not being kind to our own self. Um, and when we want to truly communicate with someone, the best thing to do is come with an open heart and um, a place of contribution and wanting to better the relationship. We need to let go of all defenses and just be there. Um, we also need to make sure that we are not attached to what the other person says. We cannot control how they communicate. We cannot control their response to us. We can only control our behaviors and actions in the conversation. Um, but really, it's really important to hone this skill for different areas of our lives because it is the thing that is going to make those areas of your lives the most successful. So in the beginning, you may need to spend some time thinking about how you want to approach a person. From an, Even if you're annoyed or angry, it does not need to be um, contentious or adversarial. You can go to the person in a very nice way and talk about the things that are bothering you, again, letting go of what they're going to bring to the table. So just a few things to mention, some talking points on communication. This could go on and on, so we will definitely come back to this in a different video. But in the meantime, if you're looking to work on your communication skills and have any questions or need any help, feel free to DM or PM me. I'm always here and want to help you and have an awesome day.